Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Planet Crafter. My name is Tristan. Um, sorry. Music out of my ears. Just checking to see if it's in the game. Uh, da -da -da -da. So we've unlocked. As all of last episode, I tried my best to get as many of these flower spreaders down. We now have the tier two. Uh, okay, so I need another fertilizer and then take one and more of these. Obviously, we're going resource gathering today. And let's take here. Oops. So the difference here is, where is one? So this one is producing 966 oxygen and 9.2 plants. The, the flower only affects the oxygen, the boost only affects the oxygen. So This one is producing 1.95 PPP oxygen and 43 plants. 43 plants is the base. Energy is 38. One second. Okay, so just look at oxygen. 996 PPQ. One nine five PPP. Is that just double? Should be more. One sixty one three twenty five. Okay, that's double there. But nine point two per plants to forty three plants. Phenomenal. We need plants to go up as well. And energy is less than double, so it's only ten higher. Not that bad to be honest. Um, what else have we unlocked? Is that it? Looks like it. Okay. So we are going to go get some super alloy. In a second. Oh yeah, I did throw down another power plant, which also consumed a lot of our resources. I brought down a... I sent up a, another uranium asteroid, or a uranium rocket, so that I could do this. Um, I'd like to get another power station going as soon as possible. Okay. I need those. Let's go. going this way we set up the oh, i set up the building i think i did off screen so just past the bunker where we're going really not far it's remarkable once you get this jetpack and once you upgrade it a bit and you get good oxygen everything is so close but until then everything is so far Okay, so 
this was outside of the bunker and we just moved it over here uh i should grab three iron we should have done that on the way oh, there's lots of iron over here not that we need Okay, so this place is a cave, and it's kind of a maze. I tend to get lost in it, at least. But it has super outlet. Well, there's the fuse. That is interesting. That is very interesting. We'll have to, I'll have to play that, that's for sure. Um, all right. Big funky looking wall there. There's not tons of super alloy in here. However, when you get the specialty thrills, you throw them in here and they give you uh they'll thrill like they'll mine super alloy. This place becomes very important for that reason. Back there. See what I mean by it's kind of a means. Got some. Go back in. Nope, that's it. Okay. Once I spend a bit of time in there, I find my way around, but every playthrough I struggle at the beginning to get my way through there. Uh, beans, I'm super excited for that. I'll leave this structure here. Yeah, you can see everything is now, or not everything, but a lot of green moss is appearing now. That plant modifier that we, the plant rocket that we sent up there really did a good boost.
Jetpack 2. Nice. It is not the top concern, though, for this moment. What do I need? Closing in your ring. Oh, I used it. I think the first thing deeper. Iron and cobalt. anything yet. Currently, we are producing 11490. 11, okay. So, 500% multiplier has the five machines. That gave us a 17,100 boot. More than double. You guys are all in effect. So this one here is producing 28.5. This one here is producing 142.5. Yeah. The same amount of energy. Lovely. Um how are we doing on heat? 750 for the nuclear fusion generator. We can't use it until we start finding the fuel for that. Um, gas is 163. We're almost on heater four. Oh my god! If we get heater four into those four th or to those five things too, that'll just quickly wipe right through this. 200 for this one. 550 for that one. Seed is 650. Okay. What is that one? Machine optimizer too. Okay, so that was the eight one then. And there we go. It's 
explosion. Three supers. And two iridium rods. I don't know why I didn't grab the ore that I need there. Alright, we're going to have to go get sulfur. Looks like I can do two. I guess I didn't need to make those two rods but I'm getting them back. Right. Come on. Hmm. You go outside. I know what I should. Okay. One second. I never use these things. here. Ah, crap. Okay, 
So how much do you guys produce? 538. So theoretically, you Two point six nine. Oh, well then. You guys back. Was that six? Seven eight nine. So we had eleven, now we have eleven. I don't care if that's me. So when I put it in, when I put the 500 multiplier on the five tier threes, we had 28,590 coming in. Now we have 181,440. So from the original at the beginning of the episode, we are producing 179,000, no, actually, sorry, 169,950 more. But we should get to here 1 MK, 1.85 MK, pretty fast. Uh, yeah, I don't for the screen too much. Iron or figure out where we're gonna put it. Make sure. So yeah, as I said, it's this one, but for plants, insects, animals, and then biomass. You can see the huge plants there is because of the rocket that we sent up at the end of last episode. Okay, um, what are we coming up to now? Well, the heat boost is giving the terraformation boost a massive thing. So this is going to go up the per bit. And then it'll calm down. Do you produce anything else? Or just... Pressure as well. Pretty fine. Not much pressure, but a bit of pressure. Yeah, not really going up. Um... Okay, so now we got to look at increasing you. There's no duplicate resources. This is a completely different setup, and it's expensive as bloody hell. Damn.
Oh, bloody hell, we got way too much stuff right now. Um, sure. Let's go get more resources. We got way too much stuff. Let's go get more resources. I can look over here now. So we are here. This is the Iranium cave here. This is the sulfur area. And this right here is that sand wall that I showed earlier. Um, so this is our giant lake. We've explored this. This is the caverns where you find aluminum on the ground and uh, super alloys in the like up top. We've explored this as well. We've explored here, here, and here. Uh, and the super alloy cave that we just went into, what is in here, the bunker is somewhere in this area. So there is more area to explore over here. There's also area to explore behind the sand wall. Over here. Here. And all of this. I've been playing this game since it was first dropped on to uh, Steam. Which was probably like two years ago. I, can't, I don't know when. But all of this was not here. Um, there, This was here. This was not. And I remember this was basically just sand. And I had built little depots, like little breathing spots all the way like around this wall, trying to find stuff and nothing. I was like, what's back here? Let's go find out. There's nothing. But there was at the time. Um, so we also have not been over here. Like, there's a lot of place we still have not been to. <laughs> it's gray now. This was never gray before. Uh, we have not been here. This is the aluminum field. Where do we want to go? What do I need? I need uranium. I need super alloy. We've been exploring over here. Let's continue. Okay. Just the rock. Sorry. We're getting to the point where new uh, resources are going to start spawning in. Yeah. Got to keep your eye on that kind of stuff. Yeah, there's the bunker. There's the cave.
No. Don't let me. won't let me deconstruct this. No. Oh. I'll take all this. Oh, the entire thing glows. Interesting. really looking we found good resources so far so I'm just looking for these at the moment Rainbow Caves. Oh, that's cool. Bolt. Oh, wow. Okay, this is like top tier stuff that we can't use. where I am either. This is getting kind of turning. Um,
Yeah, we're gonna die. Oh, I still have the stuff on me. That's weird. He used to put it all in the chat. So it'll be in the... I'll have some stuff in the blue chest. Don't have water here. Yes, yeah, see, there's a uranium cave. I knew about that. I don't know where I died. But if it's my stuff... When I pick up the, when I take all the stuff out of it, the chest disappears. Like I can't deconstruct it. Yep. Okay. Um, question. Cobalt and silicon. Now it's not going to work as fast as I need it to. seconds. Yeah, it's definitely not going to work as fast as I need it to. Find a blue chest that might find something to drink. I don't know why. Normally, this far away, I would have set up the water thing early.
Okay, so over here is a uranium cave. I'm leaving that one there. That's my door. Uh, again, once we get to the next, like once we get a better drill set going, uh, I can put it in here and it'll mine out uranium for me. I grabbed that one that I say I was no I went out the back end. So back here. No. Looks like if I just stick to the left when I come in here, I can go through. the blue beacon should have been a good di uh, directional warning. So I'll have to look in the water to see if there's any chests as well because there's a lot that tends to get put like low and then you can't see it. That's all top tier stuff. Holy crap. Except for that. Okay. Well, I'm going to do two things. One, I'm going to bring all that stuff home. And two, I'm going to move that building over here. But I do want to go home before I start. I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. It's been a pleasure. Please leave any comments that you might have. And I hope to see you all again. Have a great day, everybody.